Se va hacia el mar, ¿eh? I think that, that since I was carrying the turtle through the sea, she, she knew that she was going to get released. And she didn't go that way. She, no. she didn't go the other way. She went towards the sea. Yeah. And that's amazing, you know? And I, as soon as I left her in the, in the raw sand, she kept on going till she had some water underneath her so she could slide into the sea. And, and now I guess it's already yeah. gone by miles. Yeah. Yeah. A la green turtle. Say hello, sea. Mickey. Say Release hello. Release the rehabilitation for one month. The problem in, in Uruguay is the plastic, the pollution, the sea pollution. It's very important no not release the trash in the sea, please. No, Mickey. It's wonderful, wonderful experience, really, really nice. I hope they will be happy together there now swimming. No, really nice experience, thanks to everyone. Well, I've, I've looked at the track, it looks very difficult, it looks very bumpy, very fast. Um, looks like it could, we could be in for an extremely wild race, which will be great for spectators. Um, you know, if I can come away from here with another good haul of points, that would be really good. It would be a real challenge. Uh, only one day, practice, qualifying race, you know, all really close together. Uh, you don't need to make any mistakes and you need to be a, a quick learner. And uh, will not be an easy, uh, will not be an easy one, but uh, you know, I will give my best and uh, I have some homework to do. Definitely a lot more than the other guys that have done already uh, two races. But uh, you know, I'm eager to learn and uh, you know, to learn as quick as possible and uh, hopefully uh, make a good race and be uh, out in the front. Je vais, je vais travailler dur, un peu plus que les autres, pour essayer de, de les rattraper. Et euh, je pense que l'objectif, bon, mis à part euh, gagner la course, c'est euh, euh, voir comment ça se passe dans ce championnat, savoir si j'ai envie de continuer euh, les, les prochaines courses en Formule 1, et surtout euh, faire partie de la famille Andretti et, et quelque chose d'important. Hey, it's my first time in Uruguay and Punta del Este, but when I walked around right away, it had a familiar feeling to me this track and it's because it looks a lot and it feels a lot like surfers paradise which is actually my favorite race in, in IndyCar we used to do it's uh, it was also along the beach like this one but not only that the track layout is very similar um, having like two chicanes on one way and two chicanes on the way back and and I've been on pole on that track and I almost won and I didn't so I almost feel again like I have another chance to to get that win so double hungry
I mean, this shakedown is very, very uh, handy for uh, tricky situations like this. When you come out of a race weekend with damage on your car, so you can check everything, and uh, it's good that the cars are working. So good job, already, team. The track is pretty nice. It's very fast, uh, but with more sand than expected. I think the the wind has not helped us so far. But yeah, it's going to be a big show. I think the track is uh, really difficult. Fast corners, fast chicanes. It's going to be good. It's uh, just very good. We are very happy to be here. Uh, everybody from uh, Formula E. So it's good. Uh, good day. We are in uh, preparation for the race for tomorrow. So uh, we'll see tomorrow. I felt uh, well in the uh, check down, uh, car was uh, good, so track is uh, interesting, it's, uh, it's uh, very uh, wide sometimes, so we can uh, overtake, so for the race it's very important, and uh, some fast corner also, it's the first time in season we have a very fast corner, so it will be uh, exciting to drive and for the spectator also. I think the most exciting thing is what, what's been happening with Formula E in general, you know, I think, uh, you know, the events have been spectacular and uh, the races have been really good. and. And uh, you know we're just really excited to be involved. It feels great having John Eric uh, Verne drive for us. You know, he's uh, he's such a great talent, one of the greatest talents I think in the world. And and uh, you know to have him driving for us here in Formula E. Uh, uh, you know our intention is hopefully to keep him in the car for a while. So uh, we'll see what happens.